Hey guys, Mr. Senny20 here, and today we have a bit of a new series, which is since Possible Beast has now come to an end, even though I've done three episodes, I can't really continue because, well, the game is out and there's no point doing Possible Beast when I can actually find out if they're a beast. So, new series comes out with the same kind of concept, which is called Underrated Beasts. So what I do, I pick up a player, I show you their in-game stats through Foothead, I show you everything they have, and then I tell you if they're a beast. Well, I'm not really going to show people just shit, am I? So, they're all going to be beasts, and I'm going to give you a rating at the end, in a way. So, um, it's like a player review, but for players that you wouldn't use a lot. For, like, uh, non-informs, which are, uh, like, under 10k, or players which are cheap and amazing. Like, for expensive players and top players, it'll be a player review. For cheap players, it'll be underrated beasts review. So yeah guys, like, I'm just clearing that out and getting that out there. So let's get started. I think you can see here, it's that squad builder that I done the other day, so you probably know who I'm going to do an uh, underrated beast review on, if you remember the left end of that squad. And it is the man himself, the man loaned out from Porto, it is Itube, Itubowa. 91 pace, 81 dribbling, 69 shooting. That's what you need to know. He is so good. He is so good for 5k. 5k, so worth it. He is left footed, 4 star skills, 3 star weak foot. Only problem really is that he's left footed on the left side, but you can just change him in game to the right side. But he still works on the left side being left footed because he is just so good on the dribble. And if you just shoot a cross goal um, with your left foot from the left and you shoot a cross goal, it will go in because this guy has 69 shots. If you put like a Hawk card on him, which is um, which increases their shooting. Imagine you're shooting then. Seriously, he is really, really good. Um, his main main stats are just his pace and dribbling. He, he is so quick on the ball, and he is um, he he keeps that ball close to his feet, so close. It really feels like a Messi, due to him being left foot as well. And also, he was called the new Messi when he was coming to Porto because. Uh, everyone wanted him like United and everything, and then we bought him, and then he just ended up not being the player we thought he was going to be. He still he still has talent to him, I really want him to play well, I don't know what I'm doing here guys, but I really do want him to play well, but I don't know, he, he hasn't been working out, he hasn't got that confidence, you know what I mean? But yeah, um, he's a real good player in real life, so he's one of them players that you see in real life and you just have to use him in the game. And uh, I'm pretty, now I'm going to change screen and I'm going to show you his in-game stats. So yeah guys, now as you can see here has his in-game stats from the Foothead page and I'm just using the layout from the Possible Beast because I think it looks pretty cool. So as you can see he's got 4 star skills, 3 star weak foot, his right foot's pretty much useless when it comes to shooting, apart from that he's good at passing everything but stick to his left foot. Uh, his 4 star skills come really in handy, especially for skillers, trust me, this man's dribbling makes the ball stuck to his feet so the skills are even better so you do get some really nice goals with this man also he's around 6k 7k so pretty cheap in my opinion and price will probably go down totally worth it he's a very very good player high medium work rates are uh, decent nothing too special about it uh, he actually don't, doesn't seem like a medium because he doesn't come back too much he's mostly always attacking but his main main stats are his physical ones his agility his acceleration balance and sprint speed those are stats which are crucial crucial to literally beating a player off the dribble and he's got all of them up in the greens up in them light light greens above 90 seriously he is so so good then his dribbling is high as you can see there and his shot power is high as well with 69 shot he's got such a very good shot on him and if you put like a hunter card on him you'll even be better. Now I'm going to show you some in-game clips and I'll come back after. So yeah, hope you enjoy those clips. Not uh, not too many, I think. Uh, but yeah, I tried to get as many as I could. 
well decent ones, I only think I got like three clips in there, but oh well. Anyway, so this is really the sum of, of Iturbe uh, for this cheap beast in my opinion. He has got insane dribbling, he's a playmaker, and it's all about pace when it comes to this man at times. It's, his pace is such a plus, physically, uh, if you don't include the strength, he is so so good, he really does feel, in my opinion, like a mini Messi. Um, because, like, when he even plays in real life, when he first came to Porto, I thought he was a bit of a messy, now he's on loan. Hopefully he will improve and come back to Porto, and hopefully be a beast there. And, uh, he's got great shooting as well, his left foot is great. Just the negatives are, he's, he's weak at times, and he's useful, useless with his right foot. I give this man a 9.2 out of 10 in this player review, because, literally, he is one of the best players I've used this game so far, he is so, so good. And actually another negative that I forgot to add is that he's a left wing and I'll prefer him to be a right wing. But yeah guys, that's the sum up for this. If you do did like this play review and, and if you did like the layout and the kind of GFX, all these little uh, little things that add to, to make the video look better, uh, be sure to like because I do take quite a long time to make these videos look really good. Uh, well, I think they look good and make them look professional and as good as possible. So. If we could get 10 likes, that would be awesome. Also, if you're new to the channel, if you could subscribe and help me uh, get some more support, because that would be awesome, uh, as I am pretty, pretty interested in FIFA 14 at the moment, because, well, let's just say I'll, I'm liking uh, Ultimate Team, even though I, there is a lot of aid in the game still. Uh, I just like the way the game sometimes handles it. It's a lot about dribbling and not always about pace anymore, even though I'm going to play a review on a guy with pace. I'm really enjoying this game at the moment, at times, at times, at other times I'm just raging. So you guys, if you could subscribe, I'm just going to try to get the best content out for you guys, and try to get a series going. So you guys, if we get some likes on this video, it would be awesome, so I'll catch you guys later.